Good morning. I'd like to tell you about the love of God that heals all sick people and delivers all those who are bound and puts new legs on people that had their legs taken off and new arms on people that had their arms taken off, new organs in the body. The love of Jesus Christ and the way he displayed it on planet earth was that he healed everyone who asked him. And uh, this uh, is a standard procedure for Jesus even today. So if you have anything that you need from him, all it requires is for you to ask him. Now, love does not push itself on somebody, and love does not force you to get healed. It's up to you. In the book of John chapter 9, a man was by, born blind. They asked him, whose sin caused this? Jesus said, nobody's sin. Then he said, but because I must work the works of God, the glory of God, uh, I am going to heal him. And he did heal him. You know, the remedy for all sickness, disease, demon possession, and every kind of darkness and heartache and painful experience Every remedy boils down to one thing, the glory of God. God is wanting to put it right in everybody's life, but he never gets asked to do this. Some people think that it's just a, a, a once-off or gift or something, but something that um, establishes his messiahship. But this is not correct. It's a modus operandum. Everywhere the devil did evil, including sickness, disease, and demon possession, and everything else, Jesus set those people free, thus destroying the power of the evil one. 1 John 3 8 says, He came to destroy the power of the evil one. Now, do you have something in your life that you need to be removed? A heartache, a pain, a disease. Or maybe you are lacking an organ or a limb or something in your life. Because I'm here to tell you that even today, right now, through this internet, Jesus is going to heal you. It's a free gift. He wants to put right what the devil made wrong. He wants to heal you right now. I speak to cancer. Get out of these bodies right now. If you have cancer in your body, just listen to me. In the name of Jesus Christ, I command you to leave these people right now. I break your hold and command you to leave. Cancer, be gone. Now I speak to all sickness and disease and demon possession and everything that goes with schizophrenia, depression or any kind of mental disease. I speak to you now, get out of this life. Get out of this life now. Jesus loves them. And you're no longer allowed to stay there. Now leave these people. Leave them. You have usurped your command. The Lord is angry with you. Now leave these people and go. Go. All of you. Leave. Leave from oppressing these people. Thank you, Jesus, for giving us your power, your glory, and your kingdom. I thank you for setting people free right now, Lord. Thank you for setting them free and making them whole. Thank you for your established glory on this earth that you left behind when you went to heaven so that we could operate in it and we could be set free the same way as you set us free when you were here in person on the earth. So also today, today we are healed by your grace and your power that is left on this earth for us so that we might not be disadvantaged in any way. This is the time now for the devil to be thrown out. Judgment has come upon you, devil, and you must desist and you must give way to us. We have the key and we have the power to throw you out and we do so in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Behold. Be strong.